Today, the mother accused of taking her daughter on the run made her first court appearance. The pair was found by an alert parking supervisor at Sacred Heart Medical Center who happened to remember their faces from a flyer. Gail Mulchinski is charged with first-degree custodial interference. Today, she pleaded not guilty. She allegedly took her daughter Megan after losing a custody battle with the father. The family lived in Germany at the time, stationed at an American air base. Friday, they turned up in Spokane. KXY 4's John Langler reports. It was a simple walk out the front door and a chance encounter that ended the search for the Mulchinski women. As it turns out, though, it was the only simple thing about this case. I don't know what her state is going to be like. I'm hoping that uh, she'll be okay and that she'll go with me. If only it were that easy. For Tom Mulchinski, this is where his search ends. The Spokane County Courthouse is where he hopes to restart a life with his 13-year-old daughter. Megan. I'm excited. I'm uh, nervous. Uh, I haven't seen her, haven't had any meaningful contact in about four years. Tom says this all started in 2003. After about 20 years of marriage, Gail began to show signs of mental problems. She would tell Megan he was abusive, claims never substantiated. Doctors said that Gail was schizophrenic. After a series of court battles, Tom was granted custody. Gail took Megan and took off. Being alienated against me, she wouldn't talk to me on the phone anymore. Uh, didn't want to have any contact with me. Tom searched Germany for five weeks, not knowing Gail and Megan fled to Spokane, helped by a priest and living under the names Jill and Faith Copperfield. Megan's falling through every crack in the system, uh, trying to keep her safe, and, and so I'm just happy now that uh, she's found and she's safe and that hopefully I'll be able to take her home. But that will be a long process. Today, a family court commissioner did give custody to Tom, but there's another court hearing tomorrow that leaves things unresolved. Plus, given the allegations of brainwashing, it will be hard for Megan to accept Tom as her father again. He says he has every intention to get his daughter the help she needs. He'll start slow. I tell her it's nice to see you. I love you. I miss you. And... Uh... I'd like you to come home with me. Tonight, Megan Molchinski is once again in Child Protective Services. They'll decide what happens to her tomorrow. Meanwhile, Tom Molchinski thanks everyone at Sacred Heart Medical Center for finding his daughter. At Sacred Heart Medical Center, John Langer, KXLY4.